Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Indolis, and welcome back to Terraria. I'm right there. <laughs> so, last time, uh, we went to the jungle, and that is where we're heading right now. Um, I figured I'd go ahead and start the episode since I was already running over there. Uh, we are going to go back to the jungle and try our hardest to find... Uh, the next boss that I want to take on. So, uh, that is the goal for the day. And we're going to kill some stuff, get some worm tooth, teeth, I guess. Uh, but yeah, we're going to try to go find a beehive. That is the whole goal of today. Uh, so, just got to go to the jungle and look around a little bit more. So last time we... We did a bit of searching. Uh, we found the tavern keeper. He's still down there. Uh, that is a new mob or new NPC um, for the uh, dungeon defender uh, crossover event. I think dungeon defender is what it's called. I don't know. I will be honest. I've never played the game, but I have done the crossover event. I got bored and uh, logged into my super powerful character just to see what everything was uh, like, and um, that character is much higher here, uh, so it was a little bit different, but it was fun, and I kind of look forward to doing it uh, as a standard character, but right now we are not ready. Um, need to at least get through the dungeon. I think the key points is it unlocks when you beat the Eater of Worlds, or uh, if you have Crimson World, the, uh, oh, what's it called? Brain of Thulu. But then in, uh, be then I believe that the, uh, it levels up when you beat the Wall of Flesh, and then, um, Plantera, I believe, or the Golem, which are pretty late bosses, uh, and then the final boss, the Moon Lord. So, this is, okay. So yeah, there, there's going to be times when, um, things are not going to be that important. Uh, regarding, Ooh, we have the other things, the, uh, the spec climbing claws, cool, that's a good find, um, so yeah, right now we're not quite ready to do anything like that, just because, um, getting the dungeon and unlocking the dungeon is a fairly big, uh, milestone. Uh, the dungeon has a lot of good loot, um, but we're not quite ready to do that. I, at least I'm not quite ready to do that. Uh, so let's keep going. Uh, let's use the Amazon a little bit. Uh, so pretty much the plan that I have is we're going to try to finish up the jungle. Uh, namely finding the the, uh, the beehives and taking on the queen bee because uh, that is the boss that I want to fight today. Hopefully, hopefully we'll find her. Um, otherwise, we're gonna try to get the, the jungle armor. Um, whether or not we get it, that's kind of whatever. It's not gonna affect me much either way. Uh, because it's more of a magic armor, and right now we are heavily melee. Oh my gosh, so much stuff. That was fun. Um, the guns in this game can be fun, they can also be incredibly loud. So we didn't really get anything good in there. Uh, let's get... Thank you, Bink. Let's quick stack. Uh, put the zombie banner in there. Put the climbing claws in there. And that's about it. I do believe. Okay. So let's work our way down. 
Uh, so yeah, the, the goal is to beat the Queen Bee, uh, and then after that, uh, we will deal with the, uh, the dungeon and Skeleton Prime, or not Skeleton Prime, but Skeleton. So we have Hopper. And just a bunch of stuff trying to kill us. Uh, another heart crystal. A life crystal. Those are going to be useful. Uh, not for uh, getting more life, but rather for getting uh, more heart uh, lanterns. These things. Uh, which will increase uh, overall uh, health regeneration. So let's come down here. That's a moon glow. I don't care about that. And see. Oh, I'm confused. Alright, so let's. Let's light things up because it is super dark. And I didn't want to fish. Uh, let's kill these. Alright, this is this is bad just because I can't see and there's things out of reach trying to kill us. Alright, let's take care of the hornet. Uh, get the stingers. Alright, and there we go. So... I'm trying to light things up as I'm falling down. It's not working all that well. Uh, we have a statue. We have magic mirror. I don't care about that, but I'll take... Um, let's just do all and then put that back. Take the tungsten and we can put some stuff down here. Uh, yeah, let's clean out our inventory. I don't want the recall potions. Angel statues are cool, but not super needed. Um... Okay, that's good for right now. Let's just continue lighting things up. This is a nice wide open cave. Ancient cobalt leggings. Oh my gosh. Uh, let's switch those. Let's get this guy back out. Let's quick stack everything. Let's put those in there. Uh, Ancient Cobalt is the same as, um, oh no, that's the jungle. Uh, never mind, that's jungle, not shadow. Shadow is what, uh, is compatible with that. So let's skip. Builder's Potion. Lesser Potions, we could probably put those back. Let's put those back into the, into here. Take the angel statue and let's break this guy. And that was a pretty big failure. Let's put the statues in here and I think that should be good. Uh, let's keep that on us uh, just because we're likely to get more. And quick stack. Cool. So, let's take a look at the map. I'm not seeing any beehives yet. So we might want to come down here. And let's explore uh, all of this water. Because it goes fairly deep. Uh, must be thorns. Let's get the jungle spores and light this up. There 
is a marble marble cave right there. Um, and here we go. Get out of here. Alright, there we go. Uh, so... <sighs> not having much luck with this jungle. Uh, let's try to get to this little area. Uh, let's do something like this. And we'll lock, latch on. Up here, let's latch on. There we go. Cool. So we have a little escape. Uh, we get all that gold. In fact, I think I will. Uh, so lots of gold right here. Uh, let's turn smart. Uh, cursor off because that's going to cause problems. There we go. So let's just mine this little area right here. And we have another treasure. Uh, let's do that. And it's a cloud in the bottle, which is not something I want, but we have two Splunker potions, some healing potions, gold, and tungsten. So, otherwise, good stuff. We can quick stack in here. I don't want the Splunker Potions right now. Let's so put those away. Uh, throwing knives, I really don't need. Or the mushroom. Alright, so... Ooh, we have something down there. Alright, let's... I think that's a jungle shrine, isn't it? No. No, it's another, uh... Oh, what are they called? Uh, mining houses? Abandoned houses or something like that. I don't remember exactly what they're called, but... It's another one. Cool. They look different. Uh, it's partially because of the green light. Alright, let's... Kill this guy. I'm still not seeing any, and I mean any, thing that I want. Uh, summon the pig again. Uh, this cannot be placed here, can it? Nope. It is not a mount, it's not a pet, or anything like that. So let's quick stack all that stuff in there. Star statue, we'll put there. Alright, so... Lots of... Water. I'm still not... Oh. There we go, we got some vines. Still not seeing any beehives. Uh, so let's, sure, let's take a potion, uh, it's fine, and I wish I could remember, what's the, I guess if I, if I shift with the smart cursor, oh, okay, just shifting in general. Uh, we'll give you the, uh, uh, the option to plant torches. So I need to remember that. Alright, let's look at the map. I still don't see any beehives. This is getting annoying, to be perfectly honest. And let's shift. Alright, let's 
finding yet another. Let's get uh, the hornet needs to die first. Alright, there we go. Um, let's see, what can we do? Let's get the night out. The night out potion actually is helping a lot. Come on, just kill a man eater. Place a torch. We have M statue. Take that, that. Don't need the cobwebs. Don't need shurikens. Jungle grass seed, I do want. Don't need the rich mahogany. Uh, let's summon this guy. Oh, stupid smart cursor. Doesn't know what I want to do. It's not that smart. Alright, so let's put dynamite in there. Imp statue. And that's good enough. So we just, there's a lot of bees down here, rather hornets, let's heal, I don't want to die, it's, oh my gosh, more, okay, these are supposed to be really rare drops, and I'm getting just a ton of them, and more stingers, jungle bats, There is the cobalt leggings again. Oh my gosh, the man eaters. Um, let's come here. Let's retreat. Alright, so... Let's kill them like this. They'll eventually stick their heads out. We should be able to... Do a decent... Oh my gosh, there are so many man-eaters. This is kind of ridiculous. And I say kinda in a nice way. This is completely ridiculous. Um, alright, so let's, let's heal. And get another. These guys are really liking to spawn. Alright, so let's kill all of them that we can. We get a lot of vines out of this, which is good because it's materials. Ooh, ooh, we have a uh, living, ma uh, giant, uh, living mahogany tree. These are somewhat rare. And they always have treasure, so let's... Let's go get the treasure. Right, there it is. And we have band regeneration. That's nice. Um, danger sense. Ah, uh, cool. So, not really that good of a treasure, but treasure nonetheless. Um, just trying to decide what to do. Let's dig down, I guess. What, cobwebs? Uh, let's get torch. And we just fly around, explore a little bit. I uh, don't know what those are all about. 
Is that? I can't tell. Um, that is honey. So we have honey, which means that there should be a hive nearby. Um, that is good to know. Uh, let's see what can we click stack. Uh, let's just put some of these guys on our person. Um, don't need the cobwebs. More ancient cobalt leggings. All right, cool. So we found honey. Now that means that there is a hive somewhere. Presumably anyways. Um, can I do something like that? Alright, so we have some honey. That must mean that it is up. Right? Why is there honey blocks if there's no hive? There really should be a hive somewhere around here. And I don't know why I'm not finding one. Um, maybe we got a jungle rose. Let's come down here. Hopefully not get stuck. Alright, so we found honey blocks, but... No honey bees. I'm like, super confused of where all the hives are. Alright, so let's... Get the Amazon out and... Kill the bees. Kill the hornets. Alright, so I still don't see any signs of bees. Uh -huh, this, is, this is getting old. I want to find some bees. I want to take on the queen bee. I want to get uh, the bee themed weapons and items and all that fun stuff. There's actually a mount that if I could get would be amazing. Oh, I didn't want a mount. I wanted to uh, jump on my uh, oh my grappling hook. So, all right, let's kill this hornet. Alright, so there's honey there. And I don't know where it came from. Yeah, there's a bunch of honey right there. And there's no hive anywhere in sight. And I don't understand... I don't think it can naturally spawn unless... I'm trying to figure out, you know, when the stuff settled, where did it come from? Alright, let's, oh, let's go this way, let's heal. I'm not going to spend too much more time looking for it, I might have to look for it off camera. Which is not something I want to do considering uh, the jungle is dangerous. So let's do that. Alright, so we did get a jungle rose, which is cool. We can equip that. Uh, it's a vanity item. Gives us a nice flower in our hair. 
Um, for the sake of making this easier on myself, let's let's blow up some stuff. And maybe. Just maybe we'll find something. So let's kill that guy. And we have a beehive. There we go. Okay, finally. Um so we do need to be careful getting in here. Um I think though. <laughs> You know what? No, let's. This might be a long episode, but let's go ahead and do it. So, uh, I would like to s try to find the side of it, uh, just because I don't want to accidentally uh, the boss. <laughs> I don't want to accidentally summon the boss until I am ready. So let's get some. Hive blocks, and let's go in like. Okay. There is the uh, uh Bob, uh, the Abination. Abination. That's the uh. Oh, I need to be careful with this sword. Um, that is the item that summons the boss. Uh, it is essentially essentially um the larva. I'm blind. I'm also in honey. So let's... I'm also confused. Alright, let's get some platforms. And we're going to make some platforms in here. We are going to summon the boss. Uh, I don't know if we'll be able to beat the queen bee. We should should be able to, but then again, maybe not. Do I have, okay, I can get more platforms. Alright, and do something like here. Awesome, so we'll put the heart lantern there. Nice campfire here. Let's wait five seconds to get rid of the status effects. And I'd like to kill this man eater. So come on. I don't want to hit the the larva. Um, yeah, so this episode might be a little bit longer, but I don't think that matters too much. Um, not when I'm going to be doing the whole let's fight the boss. So let's fight the boss. Um, all we have to do is break that and the boss will summon. So let's buff and break. So there's the queen bee. Oh. She should fly above me and shoot her. Let's just like do that. Um, the shotgun might actually work fairly well. Fly above me. And right, let's heal. Uh, yo yo's are also going to be really good. Uh, and essentially, her patterns are just going to get faster as we go. Um, she's got a thousand 
hit points down. I just need to dodge. A little bit better. And I should be good. And if I keep running back and forth, that should also help a little bit. Uh, so let's... I can't heal for another 8 seconds. Alright, let's... Heal. And hopefully not die. So, Queen Bee is halfway dead. So am I, but... Uh... Alright, so... We just need to stay alive. This is intense. There we get. Oh, that was kind of intense. We got the treasure bag. We got everything. Uh, let's summon this. It's a quick stack. Uh, maybe we get everything. All right, cool. So, um, bottled honey is good. Uh, let's. I get actually I don't, I'm not gonna worry about that right now let's go home um, let's empty out our inventory and let's make some stuff and more importantly let's get some uh, loot so let's take like I don't know I don't need all I don't need these ropes on me at all times anyway so let's do that um, fallen stars I do one on me but that's for a different reason um, the sticky bombs are just temporary, so let's talk to the guide real quick because I don't remember what all we need for the armor. So it is just the spores and all right, blade of grass. We're gonna need the stingers and the spores. That's right. Um. So, Blade of Grass is a better sword than the one I have, um, but not by much, so I don't know if that I'm going to do much with it. I need a lot more jungle spores, so I'm not going to worry about that too much, but let's open up the Queen Bee's treasure bag. We got a lot of stuff. Okay, so we got the Quick Honeycomb. Uh, the Hive Pack is the expert mode item, which increases the strength of friendly bees. Uh, we got Nectar which gives us a little pet baby hornet, uh, some beeswax, the ruthless bees knees, which is a bow, um, which I do believe uh, summons bees, so we can, yeah, it shoots a line of bees that bounce, um, so that's kind of cool. Uh, we got the hive one, which allows us to place hives, and we got the bee hat. So we can be a bee. Uh, we also got some bee nades. Uh, so lots of stuff. The honeycomb is actually a really good item, and we're gonna use that later uh, with some other stuff. But yeah, I think all in all, that was a good. Um, that was a good battle. So next time, I do believe that we are going to do a little bit of work. Um, I'm hoping to do a little bit of work with uh, the base, 
uh, start making some rooms and that kind of stuff. I've considered making these rooms a little bit differently shaped. Uh, start getting some new NPCs, getting some more houses for NPCs and all that fun stuff. Uh, and wow, we have a lot. We have 98 gold. Dang. Uh, and then the other thing that we're going to be doing is preparing for. Oh, I'll be too. Uh, preparing for Skeletron. Uh, so that is the next boss fight, and I don't know that we're ready yet. Um, honestly, I know how we could be. We just come here, and we buy the mini shark. Uh, I'm gonna have to reforge that until I get the thing I want, but the mini shark is a little bit overpowered. Um, it will eat through bullets, but it is a minigun. So yeah, that is something that we're going to be using against Skeletron Prime. Not Skeletron Prime, it's just Skeletron. Skeletron Prime is hard mode. But anyways, we got a lot of good stuff. We didn't get everything that I wanted, but when we get more powerful, uh, then we'll deal with it. But for now, we will live with what we have. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!